Hey everyone. Um, I don't think that I have taken a video since I got rid of the Porsche and moved from Oregon to California. But after about a month of living here, I kind of decided that it was time for another vehicle to, or project vehicle or whatever to toy around on. And I did some thinking and did some research. I decided that a motorcycle was the way to go. And um, I work about three miles from where I live and uh, I don't really get on any freeways or anything like that. So I decided that a 250 was the way to go. And um, I ended up getting this brand new Honda CBR 250R. It's a little 250cc single cylinder motorcycle. It's just a little guy. But it's really cool. Um, 250s often have this reputation for being um, underpowered, uh, too small, you can't take them on the freeways, they're light so they get blown around by the wind or whatever. Um, but I was surprised to see that that was really not the case at all. Um, it has about it has about 22 horsepower, 24 horsepower, and about 17 torque. So the engine is tiny. Um, as you can see right here, it's this little baby engine, and when it's running, it sounds it sounds an awful lot like a riding lawnmower, which is really funny. Um, but it's peppy enough that I certainly don't have any problem problems with it. And um, yeah, it's a it's a really fun little bike. So, I went from being um, Brian the Porsche 924 Turbo Project guy to the uh, Brian the Motorcycle guy. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn it on now. Let's do another walk around. This was kind of the first thing I did was get this enormous um, uh, fuel tank protector. I look at other guys' bikes and I see that theirs are like this little tiny thing right here and I have this big monster. But, oh well, it works. It's kind of cool. So let's go ahead and turn it on so we're ready to rock and roll let's get it in neutral there's a neutral light so check this thing out and there's my little lawnmower going but it's such a cool little bike it's got this wretched exhaust that I definitely plan on getting rid of it's, look at that, it's terrible um, and like the the fender license plate holder that needs to go and it's got some silly reflectors like up here that need to go um, but let's see doesn't sound too bad um, for a single cylinder it's surprisingly smooth you would think that just a single piston pumping up and down it'd be really rough but it it's smooth you don't even you don't even notice it um, the exhaust doesn't really sound like anything the rims look kinda I guess they match the exhaust guard and some other things but I'd really like to get them painted black and have a lot of people put a red stripe down there or around the uh, rim rather um, but since I have this enormous uh, black and yellow fuel tank protector I was thinking about doing yellow we'll see how that goes um, I want to get a little more experience because I've actually never had a bike so this is like my first bike and it's perfect so I definitely want to get more experience on before I start really trying to modify it or anything like that uh, but but that's it so expect a lot more uh, videos about the bike and about modifications and things in the future I have a lot of plans for it I think it's gonna be a lot of fun it's definitely a lot of fun to ride um, it's kinda of bright uh, I definitely want to get some kind of camera on the helmet or whatever and take some some videos there's a lot of videos about 250s out there riding and people talking about passing cars because a lot of people don't think they're fast enough or powerful enough and I definitely want to be part of the cool kids so I'm going to join that crowd. Um, but that's it. So uh, no more cars for me, no more project cars for a while anyways. Um, and uh, just expect more videos about the bike. So that's it.